Um, he, he's done a lot well, and he, he's done a lot to impress not just me, but I think everybody here. Um, you know, he's really stepping up and taking a, a leadership role, especially when he gets in at QB. Um, and just every, everyday quarterback things, you know, his, his timing, his rhythm seems to be better, his drops, I mean, his accuracy. I mean, he, he's just really molding himself into a really good QB right now. Same thing, to be honest. Um, he, he, again, is taking more of a leadership role, especially when he's thrown in, you know, with the ones and, you know, uh, and I, and I think you'll see that from Evan and, and Malik and whoever gets thrown in with the ones. I think that's a whole, you know, there's an aura with it that you have to step up and you have to lead the team at this point in time. And um, and, and they do it with the twos and, and stuff when, when they uh, rotate, but I, I think it's a little bit harder, um, you know. And, you know, we'll, we'll see that going into deep into fall camp. But Malik and Evan, I mean, they're both, they're both really becoming better QBs you know they, they both realize that they're, they're not they're not backing up anybody this year you know as of now you know it's, it's their job to it's their job to win and there's nobody's job to lose at this point in time a great athlete um, he, but you know he'll have to be a great QB to win the QB battle you know I mean he, he's a tremendous athlete and uh, you know he, he can do a lot of things and you know a lot of different things than some of the guys we have here but you know at the end of the day we're gonna need a leader um, you know, we're going to need a leader. We're going to need somebody who can help us in week one win and then help us in week three win, you know, in a big game. And so, you know, it's, it's really, you know, it's a lot of shoes to fill with Brad, but we're not asking for another Brad. We're asking for another leader. We're asking for another QB who can lead this team.